Fungus gnats. A type of endoparasite that forms tunnels between the upper and lower epiderms of the leaf as they feed on parenchyma. Leaf miners. Mealybugs are insects in the family Pseudococcido unarmored scale insects found in moist, warm climates. Many species are considered pests as they feed on plant juices of greenhouse plants, house plants and subtropical trees and also act as a vector for several plant diseases. Mealybug Tiny, often parasitic arachnids living on animals or plants. Mites Minute insects that suck the juices from plant cells Scale insects Thrips feeding on strawberry blossoms cause the stigmas and anthers to turn brown and wither prematurely but not before fertilization has occurred. Western flower thrip White flies are tiny, sap-sucking insects that may become abundant in vegetable and ornamental plantings, especially during warm weather. White flies The caterpillar of a North American moth that has wingless females, cankerworms consume the buds and leaves of trees and can be a major pest. Cankerworm Eastern tent caterpillar nests are commonly found on wild cherry, apple, and crab apple, but may be found on hawthorn, maple, cherry, peach, pear and plum as well. Eastern tent caterpillars The gypsy moth had established itself throughout the northeast. It is one of the most damaging pests of hardwood forests and urban landscapes, defoliating a million or more forested acres annually. Gispy moth The Japanese beetle, Papilia japonica numen, is a widespread and destructive pest of turf, landscape, and ornamental plants in the United States. Japanese beetle These minute insects, colloquially known as hoppers, are plant feeders that suck plant sap from grass, shrubs, or trees. Leafhoppers These minute insects, colloquially known as hoppers, are plant feeders that suck plant sap from grass, shrubs, or trees. Asian Longhorn Beetle Bright green and feeds on ash. Emerald Ash Borer White grubs are the larvae of May beetles found in the genus Philophaga, of which there are over 100 different species. White grubs The apple maggot, also known as a railroad worm, is a pest of several fruits, mainly apples. Apple maggot The term cabbage worm is primarily used for any of four kinds of Lepidopteran whose larvae feed on cabbages and other coal crops. Cabbage worm The Colorado potato beetle, also known as the Colorado beetle, the ten-stripe spearman, the ten-lined potato beetle or the potato bug, is a major pest of potato crops. Colorado potato beetle Helicoverpazi, commonly known as a corn earworm, is a species in the family Noctuida. The larva of the moth Helicoverpazi is a major agricultural pest. Corn earworm Cucumber beetle is a common name given to members of two genera of beetles, Dibrotica and Acolyma, both in the family Chrysomelida. The adults can be found on cucurbits, such as cucumbers and a variety of other plants. Cucumber beetle 
Sinanthidin exodusa, the peach tree borer, is a species of moth in the family Sacida that is native to North America. The adult female of the species has a wingspan of about 3.5 cm. Peach tree borer The plum curculio is a true evil native to the regions east of the Rocky Mountains in the United States and Canada. Plum curculius Arrhenia is a genus of Enterobacteria Shiabacteria containing mostly plant pathogenic species which was named for the famous plant pathologist Erwin Frank Smith. Arrhenia Fire blight, also written fire blight, is a contagious disease affecting apples, pears, and some other members of the family Rosacea. Fire blight Bortritis blight Powdery mildew is a fungal disease that affects a wide range of plants. Powdery mildew Identify the turf grass disease depicted in the picture below. Pythium Destructive parasitic fungi causing brown rot in plants. Phytophthora One of the fungus diseases that cause root rot in lilies. Rhizoctonia Thelovipsis is a small genus of fungi in the order Microscales. The genus includes several important agricultural pathogens. Thelovipsis Anthracnose is a group of diseases that cause dark, sunken lesions in leaves, stems, flowers, and fruits. Anthracnose Parasitic fungi which grow on living plants, reducing the plant's ability to grow and mature. Rusts Scab In botany, any of several bacterial or fungal plant diseases characterized by crustaceous lesions on fruits, tubers, leaves, or stems. Scab Verticillium wilt is a wilt disease affecting over 350 species of Utica plants. It is caused by six species of verticillium fungi, V. dalliae, V. albo atrum, V. longosprim, V. nubilum, V. theabromi, and V. tricopus. Verticulum wilt A fungal disease of elm trees that is spread by elm bark beetles. Dutch elm disease Fungal wood rot characterized by the breakdown of cellulose. Brown rot. Tobacco mosaic virus is a positive sense single stranded RNA virus, genus Tobomovirus, that infects a wide range of plants, especially tobacco and other members of the family Solanaceae. Tobacco mosaic. Aster yellows is a chronic, systemic plant disease caused by a bacterium-like organism called a phytoplasma. Aster yellows Indeterminate growth A group of flowers tightly clustered together. It is a shoot specialized for bearing flowers and bearing no leaves other than bracts. Inflorescence Modified leaves that are adapted for protecting the flowers. They are often different from foliage leaves. They may be smaller, larger, or of a different color, shape, or texture. They typically, they also look different from the parts of the flower. Racks A variety of plant that originated and persisted under cultivation, usually those selected for desirable characteristics that can be maintained by propagation. They generally can be distinguished from wild plants. Cultivar A horticultural technique whereby tissue from one plant is transplanted to another. Nomenclature 
an organelle found in plant and algae cells where photosynthesis occurs. Chloroplast Respiration Tropisms a plant hormone that promotes root formation and bud growth 1, phototropism 2, thigmotropism 3, gravitropism 4, fruit set and development 5, adventitious root initiation. Auxin Synthesized in root apical meristem transported with water in xylem function 1 cell division 2 chloroplast development 3 leaf senescence inhibition 4 bud break 5 adventitious shoot initiation. Cytokinins only gaseous plant hormone functions 1. Ripening 2. Overall synthesis 3. Induction of flowering in bromeliads 4. Promote subsition. Ethylene Moves in both xylem and phloem functions 1. Elongation in internodes 2. Induction of flowering in benial 3. Phase change 4. Fruit development 5. Promote seed germination. Gibberellins Functions 1. Regulation of dormancy in temperate plants 2. Seed maturation and dormancy 3. Drought defense Abscisic acid Macro and micronutrients Primary secondary macronutrients Telephone Nutrient availability Nutrient deficiency Source Role Signs of deficiency Necessary for chlorophyll protein and enzyme synthesis and DNA or similar plant Frond A receptacle in which asexual spores are formed Sporangia The protecting film covering the epidermis of leaves, young shoots and other aerial plant organs without periderm. It consists of lipid and hydrocarbon polymers impregnated with wax and is synthesized exclusively by the epidermal cells. Cuticle Roots above the ground that are almost always adventitious. Aerial roots a substance through which roots grow and extract water and nutrients. This can consist of native soil but is more commonly an artificial soil composed of materials such as peat moss or compost. Growing medium Herbaceous Woody the main body or stalk of a plant or shrub typically rising above ground but occasionally subterranean. Stem A cellular plant tissue from which phloem, xylem, or cork grows by division, resulting in secondary thickening. Cambium The part of the plant stem from which one or more leaves emerge, often forming a slight swelling or knob. Node the part of the plant stem between two of the nodes from which leaves emerge. Internode A compact knob-like growth on a plant that develops into a leaf, flower, or shoot. It is storage for any organ that is waiting for correct conditions to open. Bud The primary growing point at the top of the stem of a plant. An example is where a flower opens up on a plant. Meristem is present in buds located here. Terminal Points of growth located at the intersection of the leaf and stem of a plant. The axillary bud is an embryonic shoot located in the axle of a leaf. Lateral A reproductive process that involves two parents that combine their genetic material to produce a new organism which differs from both parents. Sexual reproduction a type of asexual reproduction in plants where a new plant is produced from existing vegetative structures. Vegetative reproduction An unexpected growth in some place random. 
adventitious. The flattened structure of a higher plant typically green and blade-like that is attached to a stem directly or via a stalk. They are the main organs of photosynthesis and transpiration. No meristem is present on them. Leaf An arrangement of leaves in which two leaves are directly across from each other growing from a single node. Opposite an arrangement of three or more leaves, petals, or other organs arising from a single node. World A leaf with an undivided blade. The shape of the leaf may be formed of lobes, but the lobes do not reach the main vein or the midrib. Simple leaf The center vascular tube, which transports water and nutrients. Midrib the stalk between the leaf blade and the stem. Not all plants contain them. Petiole Unstalk leaves that do not possess a petiole. The lamina of the leaf expands directly from the stem. Sessile Characteristic when the leaf wraps around the stem. Sheath a leaf in which the blade is fully subdivided and each leaflet of the blase is separated along a main or secondary vein. The middle vein of a compound leaf is called the rushings. Compound leaf Leaf blades that exist on the same stalk. Leaflet Pinna equals feather X. Oaks Pinnate Meat at center Palmate Vein Lobe slash sinus A modified organ for functions other than photosynthesis. Examples include tendrils, thorns, and bracts. Modified leaf Tendril the reproductive organ of a plant consisting of reproductive organs that are typically surrounded by brightly colored corolla and a green calyx. Flower One of the small flowers making up a composite flower head. An example is the buds on cauliflower or broccoli. Florid This stem or branch from the main stem of the inflorescence that holds a group of is called a peduncle. Peduncle the thickened part of the stem from which the flower organs grow in some accessory fruits, for example the palm and strawberry, this gives rise to the edible part of the fruit. Receptacle An arrangement of sepals, petals, leaves, stipules or branches that radiate from a single point and surround or wrap around the stem. A whorl consists of at least three elements. A pair of opposite leaves is not called a whorl. Whirl. A part of the flower of angiosperms, sperms, usually green, sepals typically function as protection for the flower in bud and often as support for the petals when in bloom. A calyx is a whorl of these. This is the whorl of protection. Sepal Each of the segments of the corolla of a flower, which are modified leaves and are typically colored, they are the whorls of attraction. Petal the male fertilizing organ of a flower, consisting of a pollen containing anther and a filament. Stamen The pollen containing top of the stamen. Anther A fine powdery substance, typically yellow, consisting of microscopic grains discharged from the male part of a flower or from a male cone. Each grain contains a male gamete that can fertilize a female ovule, to which pollen is transported by the wind, insects, or other animals. Pollen The slender stalk of the stamen. Filament the female organs of a flower, comprising the stigma, style, ovules and ovary. Pistol The tube of the pistol in a flower. Style The sticky pollen collecting top of the pistol. Stigma Fertilization versus pollination
a modified leaf or scale, typically small, with a flower or flower cluster in its axil. Bracts are flowers that lack either stamens or pistils and may or may not have sepals or petals. These flowers only contains one gender. Imperfect a class of angiosperm plants that have leaves with parallel veins, flower parts in multiples of three, and fibrous root systems. Their primary vascular bundles are scattered throughout the stem, not arranged in a ring. Grasses, palms, lilies, irises, and orchids are examples. They never get woody. Monocot Dicot 1. Tab roots 2. Fibrous 3. Tuberous Types of roots A straight thicker root growing vertically downward with subsidiary rootlets forming out from the center. Tab roots Phloem A type of transport tissue in vascular plants. It brings water and nutrients up from the roots upwards to the leaves. This tissue turns into wood each year. The elements of this tissue are 1. Tertiary 2. Sclerenchyma 3. Parenchyma Xylem Pith one reproductive mature to trigger transition from vegetation to floral three formation of flowers in whorls. Requirements for reproduction The transfer of pollen from male reproductive structures to female reproductive structures in plants. Pollination A living organism that make energy by performing photosynthesis and is stationary. What is a plant? Horticulture The adapting of wild plants for human use. Plants are raised for food, work, clothing, medicine, and many other uses. Plant domestication The study of plants Botany the elongated sucking mouth part of certain insects such as butterflies. They are double-barreled and normally rolled up. Proboscis Active during the day. Diurnal. Active during and night. Nocturnal. Active during dawn and dusk. Crepuscular. Father of taxonomy established his classification of living things, famous for animal naming system of binomial nomenclature. Carl Linnaeus. A classification grouping that consists of a number of similar, closely related species. Genus Second part of scientific name Specific epithet An organism's genetic makeup or allele combinations Genotype An organism's physical appearance or visible traits Phenotype each organism is slightly different from the other. It can come from sexual reproduction. Variety Form A breeding technique that involves crossing dissimilar individuals to bring together the best traits of both organisms. Hybridizing this section of tissue at the tip of a plant root contains statocytes which are involved in gravity perception in plants. Protect meristem in root from being damaged as the roots grow. Root cap Growth that stops once a genetically predetermined structure has completely formed. Determinant growth a type of growth characteristic of plants in which the organism continues to grow as long as it lives. It is dependent on growing conditions rather than time. Indeterminate growth A group of flowers tightly clustered together. It is a shoot specialized for bearing flowers and bearing no leaves other than bracts. Inflorescence Modified leaves that are adapted for protecting the flowers. They are often different from foliage leaves. They may be smaller, larger, or of a different color, shape, or texture. They typically, they also look different from the parts of the flower. Bracts 
a variety of plant that originated and persisted under cultivation, usually those selected for desirable characteristics that can be maintained by propagation. They generally can be distinguished from wild plants. Cultivar A horticultural technique whereby tissue from one plant is transplanted to another. Tropisms a plant hormone that promotes root formation and bud growth 1. Phototropism 2. Thigmotropism 3. Gravitropism 4. Fruit set and development 5. Adventitious root initiation. Auxin. Synthesized in root apical meristem transported with water in xylem function. 1. Cell division 2. Chloroplast development 3. Leaf senescence inhibition 4. Bud break 5. Adventitious shoot initiation. Cytokinins. Only gaseous plant hormone functions 1. Ripening 2. Overall synthesis 3. Induction of flowering in bromeliads 4. Promotes abscission. Ethylene Moves in both xylem and phloem functions 1. Elongation in internodes 2. Induction of flowering in biennial 3. Phase change 4. Fruit development 5. Promotes seed germination. Gibberellins Functions 1. Regulation of dormancy in temperate plants 2. Seed maturation and dormancy 3. Drought defense The part of a plant that attaches it to the ground or to a support typically underground conveying water and nourishment to the rest of the plant via numerous branches and fibers. It is what is in the pot. Roots the part of a plant that comes up above the ground when it is just beginning to grow or a new part that grows on an existing plant. It is what is out of the pot containing the photosynthetic parts of the plant. Shoots A compact knob-like growth on a plant at a growing point that develops into a leaf, flower, or shoot. It is the location in which new material is being generated. I a technique used for asexual reproduction of plants that do not have a single stem or crown. A few examples would be hostas, mums, ornamental grasses, and many perennial flowers. Propagation by division A continuously growing horizontal underground stem that puts out lateral shoots and adventitious roots at intervals. They develop from axillary buds. Rhizome a creeping above ground horizontal plant stem or runner that takes root at points along its length to form new plants. Stolon The leaf or leaf like part of a palm, fern, or similar plant. Frond A receptacle in which asexual spores are formed. Sporangia the protecting film covering the epidermis of leaves, young shoots and other aerial plant organs without periderm. It consists of lipid and hydrocarbon polymers impregnated with wax and is synthesized exclusively by the epidermal cells. Cuticle Roots above the ground that are almost always adventitious. Aerial roots a substance through which roots grow and extract water and nutrients. This can consist of native soil but is more commonly an artificial soil composed of materials such as peat moss or compost. Growing medium Herbaceous Woody the main body or stalk of a plant or shrub, typically rising above ground but occasionally subterranean. Stem A cellular plant tissue from which phloem, xylem, or cork grows by division, resulting in secondary thickening. Cambium The part of a plant stem from which one or more leaves emerge, often forming a slight swelling or knob. Node the part of a plant stem between two of the nodes from which leaves emerge. Internode A compact knob-like growth on a plant that develops into a leaf, flower, or shoot. It is storage for any organ that is waiting for correct conditions to open. Bud the primary growing point at the top of the stem of a plant. An example is where a flower opens up on a plant. Meristem is present in buds located here. Terminal 
points of growth located at the intersection of the leaf and stem of a plant. The axillary bud is an embryonic shoot located in the axle of a leaf. Lateral A reproductive process that involves two parents that combine their genetic material to produce a new organism which differs from both parents. Sexual reproduction a type of asexual reproduction in plants where a new plant is produced from existing vegetative structures. Vegetative reproduction An unexpected growth in some place random. Adventitious The flattened structure of a higher plant typically green and blade-like that is attached to a stem directly or via a stalk. They are the main organs of photosynthesis and transpiration. No meristem is present on them. Available water capacity is calculated as Nitrogen This macroelement is a component of protein and chlorophyll and is the most limiting element in crop production except for legumes. AC Young soils have the following horizons Roundness, sphericity Stone shape is determined by these properties Hydrometer method Soil texture could be determined in the laboratory by Door plantings or gardens for miles, airports, hotels, and restaurants. Horticulture supplies. Industry that markets and sells pots, soil, fertilizer, etc. Turf grass grower. Person in charge of propagating, growing, and marketing turf grass. Grounds maintenance. Cares for land area and plants that surround a business, school, church, industry, or other public or private places that have lawns and plants that have to be maintained. Garden Center Employee Cares for plants, moves plants and supplies, arranges and displays plants and supplies, and sells plants and supplies. Park Employee Maintains plants, grounds, buildings, facilities, equipment and driveways in national, state, city, or private works. Plant breeder Professional occupation which consists of reproducing plants both sexually and asexually usually employed by major companies or universities in most propagation is done in labs. Horticulture extension agent Professional occupation which involves helping homeowners and commercial growers with horticulture problems employed by counties. Nurseryman Manages and is in charge of all propagating, buying, and selling of plant stock for a nursery. Green industry employee Work in jobs that are environmentally friendly and have to do with reusing, recycling, and reducing the carbon footprint. Career Skills depend on the blank in horticulture. Inside, outside, in a group or alone working with people or plants, routine tasks or varying tasks, physical strength. Qualifications 
Unskilled job. High school education or less. Skilled jobs. Technical degree. For most professional areas because of the required licenses, paperwork, research, and teaching. Bachelor's, Master's, or Ph.D. Examples of deciduous plants. Southern red oak, bald cypress, and red maples are all. Transpiration. The biological term used to describe giving off moisture is biennial. A plant that completes its life cycle in two years. Node. The term used to describe the biological place where that plants grow out of the stem is called a deciduous plant. A blank drops its functional leaves during the dormant season. Horticulture Floriculture, nursery production, and ornamental horticulture all fall under the plant science of Landscaping horticulture Blank is the science and practice or propagating, growing, maintaining, and using plants, shrubs, and trees in the landscape. Agronomy Blank is the science and practice of growing corn, tobacco, wheat, and soybeans. Olariculture Blank is the science and practice of growing vegetables. Purpose One way to distinguish among plant sciences is to look at the blank for which it is grown. Pomology The science and practice of growing and harvesting fruits and tree nuts is called Evergreen plant A plant that retains its leaves through the dormant season is in Perennial A plant that completes its life cycle in three or more years is Auxin Hormones that speed up plant growth by stimulating cell enlargement is Photosynthesis The beginning of the food chain for all living things is caused by the biological process in plants known as Light Photosynthesis can only take place in the presence of Floriculture The science and practice of growing flowers and flowering plants is called Examples of evergreen plants Pines, hollies, and spruces are all Biology The science that deals with the origin, history, characteristics, habits, and processes of plants and animals is called Zoology The part of biology that deals with animals is called Botany The part of biology that deals with plants is called Forestry The science and practice of growing, managing, and harvesting trees for building materials or others wood products is called Warm season plants Blank grow best in warm temperatures during summer and early fall Cool season plants Blank grow best in cool temperatures during spring and late fall Fertilization Blank is when the pollen travels down the style, joining the sperm and the ovule Tree 
A plan with a woody, single, erect trunk and a definite crown usually with a minimum height of 15 feet is a shrub. A plan with several woody stems, low growth habit, not getting over 10 feet is a ground cover. Blank is a perennial, low-growing plant that thrives in areas that grass won't grow and has a horizontal growth habit. Dormant Blank is a stage when the plant rests and grows very little in response to adverse conditions like extreme heat and cold. Turgid The biological term to describe the process when plants are swollen with moisture is Wilted Condition when the plant is limp because it does not have enough water is called Gibberellias Hormones that stimulate elongation, premature flowering and breaking of dormancy are called Hormones Blank are chemicals that inhibit and hasten fruit ripening, inhibit or restrain seed germination and stem elongation. Cytokinins Hormones that work with auxins to speed up growth by cell divisions are called Wilted turgid. Terms dealing with moisture in a plant Horticulture, agronomy, forestry, look at its purpose. Three areas of plant sciences and how to tell the difference. Pomology, olariculture, floriculture, landscape horticulture. Four divisions of horticulture. Note, petiole, epidermis. Three leaf parts. Photosynthesis, fertilization, transpiration. Two plant processes. Evergreen plant, deciduous plant. Two terms referring to leaf retention. Cytokinins, gibberellias, auxin. Three plant hormones. Warm season plants, cool season plants. Two terms that refer to the effect of weather on plant growth. Biology, zoology, botany. Three sciences. Scientific name. The unique name of a plant is referred to as the plants. Taxonomy. The science of classifying and naming plants. Carl von Linn The Swedish botanist that developed the binomial system for naming plants was Two Latin names, a generic name and a specific name The binomial system gives a plant blank Taxonomists Scientists and botanists that identify and classify plants. Generic name slash genus. The first word of the scientific name is the specific name slash species. The second word of the scientific name is the variety or cultivar name. The third word of the scientific name is the because it's a worldwide language. Why are names written in Latin? Variety is a species difference that happens in nature and cultivar is a man-made species difference. What is the difference between variety and cultivar? Characteristics Plants in the same genus have similar type. 
Plants in the same species consistently produce plants of the same blank. To avoid confusion, why is it important to use scientific names instead of common names? Kingdom The broadest category in the scientific classification system is the algae, fungi, lichens. The divisions in the plant kingdom include what plants? Thalophytes slash bryophytes. True mosses, liverworts, include lower plant forms that don't produce stems or leaves. Pteridophytes. Ferns, horsetails, club mosses. Spermatophytes. Flowering and seed bearing plants. Angiosperm and gymnosperm. Types of spermatophytes. Gymnosperm. Cone bearing plants that produce open seeds. Conifers. Angiosperm. Produce seeds enclosed in an ovary wall. Includes flowering plants and grasses. Monocot and dicot. Types of angiosperm Monocot One seed leaf Dicot Two seed leaves Parallel The venation pattern for monocots is Punit slash palmate the venation pattern for dicots is Vines Blank creep along the ground or climb some type of support using tendrils or aerial roots. Needle leaf and broadleaf The two types of evergreens are Dogwood Cornus Oak Kirkus Pine Pinus Holly Ilex Maple Azer Daily Hemericalis Juniper Juniperus Birch Betula Cypress Cupressa saparis Cypress Cummy saparis Crepe myrtle Lagerstomia Peach Prunus Pear Pyrus Azelia Rhododendron Arborvitae Puja Fig Ficus Is the leaf stuck or part that connects the leaf to the stem? Petiole The vein in the center of a leaf Midrib Flat part of leaf Blade The structural framework of the leaf Veins The edge of the leaf Margin Leaf tip Apex Epidermis Upper and lower blank is the skin of the leaf that prevents the loss of too much moisture. Stoma The small openings under the leaf for breathing or transpiration. Guard cells 
surround the stomates and regulate the open and close of the stomates. Chloroplasts Small green particles that contain chlorophyll give leaves their green color and are necessary for photosynthesis. Photosynthesis a process by which plants capture sunlight and use it to convert carbon dioxide and processing and marketing of field crops. Agronomy Cultivation Processing and marketing trees for wood products. Forestry Growing, harvesting, storing, processing and marketing of tree-grown fruits. Pomology Growing, harvesting, storing, processing and marketing of vegetables. Olariculture Growing, harvesting, storing, processing and marketing of flowering plants. Floriculture Science and practice of propagating, growing, and selling shrubs and trees for the landscape provides a commercial source of plants. Nursery Science and practice of planting and maintaining shrubs and trees for the landscape in the home grounds and other areas. Landscape Industry that produces sod, plants, and maintains home lawns, golf courses, athletic fields, etc. Turf grass The science and practice of growing, maintaining, and processing grapes. Viticulture A decorative object, a plant grown for its beauty rather than its use. Ornament Floriculture and Nursery Landscape Ornamental has two categories. Landscaping Turf Grass Flowering Plants Aesthetics Ornamental Horticulture Crops are grown for Pleasing in Appearance Aesthetics Appearance of homes and buildings at land through horticulture Ornamental horticulture improves Clean air prevents erosion provides shade nutrition Ornamental horticulture helps 25 billion into U.S. economy provides jobs produces food increases home value through landscaping. Horticulture economic benefits A multi-billion dollar industry. Horticulture is 68 million 250 thousand dollars. Local county $872 million State Lots of risk, work, cost more to grow hoard crops than other crops due to more labor and capital unit of land. Intensive production Continue Vegetable greenhouses allow the grower to blank growing and work season and profit margin. Population and new home construction Outlook is for the horticulture industry to grow because of the increase in 10% in value well-landscaped houses go up. 
Landscape Architect Draws and designs landscapes on paper or with computers. Florist Grows flowers, designs and arranges flowers. Chemical Scientist Professional occupation that involves researching chemicals to aid in growing plants. Processing and marketing of field crops. Agronomy. Cultivation, processing and marketing trees for wood products. Forestry. Growing, harvesting, storing, processing and marketing of tree-grown fruits. Pomology. Growing, harvesting, storing, processing and marketing of vegetables. Olariculture. Growing, harvesting, storing, processing and marketing of flowering plants. Floriculture. Science and practice of propagating, growing, and selling shrubs and trees for the landscape provides a commercial source of plants. Nursery Science and practice of planting and maintaining shrubs and trees for the landscape in the home grounds and other areas. Landscape Industry that produces sod, plants, and maintains home lawns, golf courses, athletic fields, etc. Turf grass The science and practice of growing, maintaining, and processing grapes. Viticulture A decorative object, a plant grown for its beauty rather than its use. Ornament Floriculture and Nursery Landscape Ornamental has two categories. Landscaping Turf Grass Flowering Plants Aesthetics Ornamental Horticulture Crops are grown for Pleasing in Appearance Aesthetics Appearance of homes and buildings at land through horticulture Ornamental horticulture improves Clean air prevent erosion provides shade nutrition Ornamental horticulture helps 25 billion into U.S. economy provides jobs produces food increases home value through landscaping. Horticulture economic benefits A multi-billion dollar industry. Horticulture is 68 million 250 thousand dollars. Local county. $872 million State Lots of risk, work, cost more to grow hoard crop than other crops due to more labor and capital unit of land. Intensive production. Continue. Vegetable greenhouses allow the grower to blank growing and work season and profit margin. Population and new home construction. Outlook is for the horticulture industry to grow because of the increase in 10% in value.